This video is about the window settings you need to disable to boost FPS and fix stutters in your games. These features might sound helpful, but in reality, they drain CPU power, memory, and bandwidth that your games need. After turning them off, I saw smoother gameplay and more consistent FPS. And the best part is you can do the same on any PC. This is all about FPS boosts, but what about ping here? Gear Up Booster comes in to optimize your network and reduce latency. Want super low ping in all the games? That's where Gear Up Booster comes in clutch. Download Gear Up Booster right now with the top link in my video description. It finds the best DNS servers near you to cut ping, fix lag spikes, and keep your game smooth and stable. And the best part? You can try it completely free. One of the most overlooked settings that can secretly hurt your gaming performance is Windows Delivery Optimization. To find it, open the Windows search bar and type delivery. Then click on delivery optimization settings. Once the window opens, you will see an option here called allow downloads from other PCs. By default, Windows may use your system to share update files with other devices on your network or even with strangers over the internet. While this feature helps Microsoft SpeechOff speed up updates, it also eats away at your bandwidth and system resources. The result? Higher latency, stuttering, and even FPS drops in online games like Fortnite, Warzone, or Valorant. The fix is simple, just toggle this setting off. Once disabled, you'll free up extra bandwidth, reduce background CPU usage, and notice smoother gameplay with faster loading and lower input delay. Now let's talk about third-party services because these can quietly eat up resources and hurt your FPS. To clean things up, press Windows plus R, type msconfig and hit enter. This opens the system configuration window. Head over to the services tab and before you do anything, make sure to tick the box that says hide all Microsoft services. That way you won't accidentally disable anything critical that Windows needs to run. After that, you'll see a list of third-party services, many of which run in the background even when you don't need them. Things like printer utilities, cloud sync tools, or update checkers can usually be disabled without any issues. Once you've unchecked the ones you don't need, click apply, then OK, and restart your PC. This restart is important because it clears out unnecessary services and frees up valuable system resources. The result is less background clutter, smoother performance, and in many cases, higher and more stable FPS in games like Fortnite, Apex, or Warzone. All right. The next step is to disable unnecessary background window services that quietly drain system resources. Open your Windows search bar, type services, and open the services manager. You'll see a long list of services running in the background, and a lot of them aren't needed for gaming at all. Now let's go through a few of the most important ones you should disable right away. First, in the B section, Look for BitLocker Drive Encryption. If you're not actively using BitLocker to secure your drives, right-click it, open Properties, set the startup type to Disabled, click Stop, then Apply, and OK. Next, scroll to the C section and find Connected User Experiences and Telemetry. This service only collects and sends data to Microsoft. It does nothing to help your performance, so disable it. Moving on, in the D section, there's the Distributed Link Tracking Client. This is only used for file tracking across networks, which you don't need for gaming, so turn it off. Another one is Remote Registry, under the R section. This allows changes to your registry from other devices, which is unnecessary for most users, and can even be a security risk. Disable it the same way. Finally, you can also manage Windows Update here. Setting it to manual or disabled prevents update from running in the background 
and stealing resources while you play. Just make sure to check for updates manually from time to time to keep your system safe. Once you've disabled these, restart your PC and you'll notice less background clutter, more available resources, and much steadier FPS while gaming. One of the biggest FPS killers that many gamers overlook is unnecessary startup programs. To find them, right-click your taskbar, open Task Manager, and head over to the Startup Apps tab. Here, Windows shows you everything set to run in the background, along with its impact rating. Focus on apps marked Enabled with Medium or High Impact since these are the ones dragging your system down. Things like Discord, Steam, Spotify, Adobe services, OneDrive, or manufacturer bloatware don't need to start with Windows. Simply right-click and select Disable to stop them from running at startup. Don't worry, this won't uninstall the apps. It just prevents them from auto-launching. Of course, keep important items like audio drivers, antivirus, or gaming overlays enabled. Disabling the rest frees up CPU resources, reduces background load, and gives you a smoother gaming experience with more stable FPS right from the moment you power on your system. Next up, let's talk about the High Precision Event Timer, also known as HPET. Open your start menu, Type Device Manager and open it up. Scroll down to System Devices, then look for High Precision Event Timer. Right click it, choose Disable Device, and confirm. That's it. By turning this off, you remove a bit of background overhead that Windows is constantly managing. For you, this means smoother frame pacing, lower input delay, and more stable FPS. Another setting you need to check is Core Isolation. Open your Start menu and type Core Isolation, then click on it. In the Settings window, you'll see an option called Memory Integrity. If it's turned on, switch it off and then restart your PC for the change to take effect. With Core Isolation disabled, your CPU no longer wastes resources on virtualization overhead which means smoother gameplay, more consistent frame rates, and less input delay. Don't worry, your system will still be secure as long as you're running a trusted antivirus. This tweak alone can give you a nice performance boost, especially if you're gaming on a mid-range or budget system where every bit of CPU power counts. The next setting you'll want to disable is Storage Sense. When it runs while you're gaming, it can cause random stutters, higher disk usage, and even FPS drops. Here's how to turn it off. Open your Start menu and type Storage Sense, then click on it. In the Storage Settings, you'll see the option for Storage Sense at the top. If it's switched on, simply toggle it off. That's all you need to do. By disabling Storage Sense, you prevent Windows from running cleanup tasks while you're playing, which keeps your system resources fully focused on your game. This leads to smoother performance, fewer interruptions, and more consistent FPS across the board. If you still want to free up space, you can run a manual cleanup whenever you're not gaming, but keeping this setting off during gameplay ensures maximum stability and responsiveness. That's all for today's FPS Boost Guide. Disable these settings and enjoy smoother gameplay right away. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like the video and subscribe for more performance tips.